One of the ways that one thing I like to do in uh, Guild Wars 2 is to help uh, people. And to help people, you can look in the chat and it says giant up over here. So here there's like a, some sort of event and most of the time they're new players and they need help. So what I would do I was just go to them. I was just I would just go to where they are. And if I can help them, I help them, you know. And this is one thing I love to do because I, I've been doing so much world v world and so much PvP that I completely forgot that you know there are people who may need help to level up to get where I am. Oh shit, this guy, yeah, oh, oh shit, wait a second, I'm gonna go with this and this, alright. Yeah, I gotta be careful here. Alright, here we go. Like, this champion is no joke. This champion is no joke. So I'm gonna help this guy. Is it, what's his name? Al Sander? Oh, he's the one who actually asked for help. So, see this guy here? He's a new player. So I just came here to help him, you know? Which is a very nice, very good thing. It's good to help people who are starting, so that's one thing you can do if you don't know what to do in Guild Wars 2 once you reach, you know, the end game. Because people are looking for end games in pretty much every MMOs and they don't know what to do. So this is one thing I love to do is to go into a, like a beginner zone map. So this is like a beginner zone map. 15 level 15 to 25 and I just I just farm around because I do need some mats like iron ore uh, I do farm the iron ore and That's people in chat going. they were gonna ask for help Return to your post. and uh, you know Thanks like you help them see this is uh this is a see this is a veteran player so he helped, he came to help uh, this is a new player as a veteran I think is this there anybody else and its no so this Thanks. so there this is the one who needed help this village still stands and it's so yeah guys um like I said if you wanna if you want if you want to find something to do instead of like world v world PvP raids you know like uh, dungeon uh, what is it uh, fractals tier 4 you know all these hardcore thing one of the thing I love to do as an end game feature to me personally is to help new players you know in certain events so i just i just farm around like newbie zone as you can see uh, it could be here it could be anywhere like when you say level 15 to 20 like over here i just go there and i farm uh, i farm like mats because i need low mats for like end game crafting right and while i'm there farming i just look at the chat and see who needs help and i just go and help them and they're happy you know what i'm saying so if you do that uh, you're gonna feel good because remember that when you started Guild Wars 2 you were new as well we were all new and we needed help you know when we started so if you can pay back by helping the new players it's a very nice very gentle very nice thing to do and I and I very and I thank you for that if you help them all right guys so yeah I hope you like this video please like us up thanks for watching cheers all right here's I see this iron ore this is this is important mats. This is important mats for end crafting and game crafting. Uh, I want to see I have the right thing. Nope, I'm gonna go with this guy over here. I usually go with glyph of bounty to get 33% chance to gain extra strike. Or iron ore. There we go.